Hey, so I uh, just got back from the mall and it's Saturday night and I thought that I would shoot a little haul video because I went a little crazy for me at the mall. I don't go shopping too often. So let me just share with you what I got. Uh, the first place I went was I went to Ulta and I've been really obsessed with facial mists lately and they have these uh, sale right now on um, this Kermance. I really like the Evian but they're all out and this kind has aloe vera in it so I haven't tried the aloe vera kind yet but that's all they had because um, they were on sale. So I got two of these and the cool thing about this is that it stays cool so you don't have to worry about your water getting hot. So you can just be at work and if you feel flushed you just or just if oh my gosh this one's broken it's like leaking all over the place that's never happened to me before oh well of course that would happen um let's try this one. Oh yeah so these are super cool for the beach or for work or you know anytime your face might get hot so I love those, and this one's defunct. That really pisses me off. I guess the top might not have been on good enough. I don't know. So then I got some more um, falsies. These are wispier than the ones I have on right now. Um, I don't know. I just got three pairs for $9.99. I thought that was a pretty good deal. So, oh my gosh, now I'm all wet. Oh. Okay, so um, let's see what else did I get. This is like hardcore impulse shopping. Hardcore. I got some um, waterproof eyeliner in silver from Stila for the beach. And I'm really excited. The color is Triggerfish. So um, let me show you how beautiful this color is. So, yeah. It's not showing up well um, because of the lighting, but it's a silver more of a grayish silver but it's still a silver so and I had to have the silver kind of wish it was a lighter silver yeah. oh well it'll be good so um then you know they have that little thing at checkout where you know you always impulse buy I ran out of this, my hairstylist gave me this unique one to put on the ends of my hair after my showers. So I picked up some more uh, stuff but a different brand because I've been wanting to try this macadamia and it smells so good. So I bought this and then when I checked out they gave me this as a reward. It's a 10 spray which is fine because I like it's a 10 but the smell makes me nauseous after a while, so I kind of prefer, um, you know, like Moroccan oil or macadamia oil, like just oils. I think they smell like fresher than the really um, thick ones, like it's a tin lottie lotta. So the second store I went to was my favorite store in the whole wide world. And that is Lush. And I um, I went there to get my Angels on Bare Skin, which is what I use on my face, um, like as my face wash, and I love it. But um, they were out because it's such a popular product. So they suggested um, to get Coal Face because that's really good for oily skin and seeing as summer's coming up and I live in Florida and the humidity is just bonkers, 
I thought I'd give it a try, so I bought a little bit of it. It's like a black bar soap. It's not mushy like Angels on Bare Skin. So I'm kind of hesitant about trying something new on my skin, but you know, it's just a soap, so I don't think it's going to be like too life or death. And then um, I couldn't resist. I got a bath bomb. And it's, oh my gosh, it smells like fresh cut grass. And that's one of my favorite smells on earth. So I cannot wait to use that. And um, the girl at the checkout counter, she was telling me that they have a bunch of Easter products, like little carrot bath bombs and stuff. And I thought that was so cute because carrot, I mean, not carrots, Easter is my mom's favorite holiday. And I really wanted to get her something, but I didn't because I'd have to mail it. And... She says, like, the bath bombs do break in the mail quite often, and I didn't want to risk that. So, um, then moving forward, the third place I went was Tivana, and I actually had a gift card for Starbucks that I used at Tivana, and a girl that I know at work, she is in love with their, um... I don't know how, it, what it's called. It's called Dragon, no, Green, it's a green tea, and it's, like, called Dragon Pearl Phoenix Tea, and, um, it's, I got this little tin for it. I thought it was so cute. It's called J Jasmine Dragon Pearls Green Tea, and the guy that I bought it from was like, oh my gosh, I'm so happy knowing somebody else loves this tea as much as I do, and I was like, um, yeah, I was just told to get it, so, I mean, somebody does, this girl at my work does, so I guess it works, but there are these, like, little pearl-sized green tea balls, and I was like, yeah, so I love that, and I love my little tin, it's really pretty, they had a purple one that I wanted that I saw the other day ago, but they were out when I went back, so I got the green. And, um, I needed something to steep it in, so this was on sale, it's originally $25, I got it for $14, and it's this little tea brewer that you can brew your tea in, I'm not sure how it works, um, okay, so... Okay, yeah, like I'm, I'm so not sure how this thing works. I guess you put hot water in this tea and it um, just like makes the tea for you. I don't know. Let me open it. Yeah, that must be what, it, what happens. You, um... You just put wa hot water in here and you put the tea in there and um, like it steeps it for you and then you can just like share it and stuff because I got this tea to share and I didn't want like um, I don't know to, to get like a um, like one of those little things that you buy for loose tea that that's like a spoon with little holes in it because that'd be kind of gross if you were dunking that like in everybody's mug so this is way better so I'm excited about that and then the last place I went was my favorite store my another one of my favorite stores Sephora and I said, um, listen, I'm going to start going to the beach soon. I need a foundation for the beach. What do you recommend? And actually, what I should have got was the Dior airbrush um, makeup. But I didn't have $62 to spend on that. So I got the Sephora airbrush makeup. And the girl working there had it on. And she said, you know, it didn't break her out or anything, you know. And I know I could take it back if it did, so I got it in medium, and there's no oil in it, which I love, and 
I'm thinking it'll be good for the beach. So I'm excited about trying that. And with my points, I scored the St. Tropez um, facial tanning cream and um, bronzing lotion for face. And I really think that will be cute for when it gets warmer too. I'm wondering if it's like what exactly it is. Okay, it's like color. Okay. It's just a self tanning lotion. I'm not really into having a tan anyways. I mean, I love the sun, but I don't really care about a tan. So that was my haul for today. I hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed sharing with you. And um, let me know if you liked it or if you didn't like it, if you hated it. That's cool too. Um, I will be posting this soon probably. Maybe not. Who knows? Um, 